Alright guys, so this is going to be a video on uh, the new Invisible Shield HD Advanced Clarity uh, glass-like surface for the iPhone 4 and 4S It's also case friendly um, Basically what differs from this and the original uh, is that it allows for uh, easier installation I think um, and also, uh, I think it's a little bit thinner, and it definitely feels smoother. Uh, feels more like glass. Um, uh, it was put on probably at around 5 p.m. and it is now 10, so it's been about five hours. Um, you can see it there definitely. Um, it kind of doesn't go to the edge. I don't know if you guys can see that, but it does not go to the edge at all on the phone anywhere. Uh, which is really cool because it allows for cases uh, without messing up the screen protector. And it also uh, allows for, like, when you put it in your pocket, it's not going to mess up or anything. So, I'll show you real quick. Uh, turn this off. You can get the full effect. Now I'll show you how it doesn't glare. But... Uh, I mean, you can barely. Oh, just one sec. I mean, you can barely even notice that it's on. Um, okay, so I mean, it's it's smooth. It's responsive. I mean, all the keys work perfectly fine. Um, you you really don't even know it's there. And even with like a with like the sound or with light, um, and my brightness actually is not even turned up very high. It's only there. I mean, you can still see with like even kind of a darker background. There's not much of a glare. There's a little bit um, of the camera reflecting, but besides that, it's really not that bad. Um, now, I am going to be using this Invisible Shield in conjunction with uh, a new case that I just got. I'm gonna try out uh, Cruiser double layer case uh, for the iPhone 4S uh, Platinum. Uh, it's a perfected case chemistry. Uh, technically, it's made by Sadio, but that's the only part of the box where Sadio is on it. So I don't know if they're trying to hide their name or what, uh, but this is uh, definitely looking like a cool case. This is it right here, actually. Um, I don't know if you can see this has a holster with it. Um, one-handed. That's what it looks like. I cannot install this yet uh, because uh, the guy at Best Buy told me to wait to do that uh, because the thing is still drying and uh, whatever you do if you install this do not put it in your pocket within the first 24 hours or you will mess it up. Um, there'll be fuzzies all over it and stuff and you do not want that. Um, and here is that case that I was talking about. I'm going to do a full review on it, obviously, once I have it on and use it. Um, but, so also, what I see might be a problem. This is actually uh, kind of clothy. You can see it's not smooth at all. It's actually cloth. Um, I mean, it's a good idea, but I don't know how it's going to work with the invisible shield. I may or may not have to have it like that, um, depending on what it does to the invisible shield. Uh, hopefully no fuzzies get on it, but that's why I'm waiting, obviously, to use the case. Um, but I feel as though that the the edges of this case will not uh, interfere with the uh, perimeter of the invisible shield. Uh, but if it does, I will be sure to let you guys know. Um, so, yeah guys, I'll get on that.